make this Parmigiano Reggiano, it comes from the milk of very special cows. It's a 70 pound wheel and it's rich and sweet and nutty. Hard white cheeses like Parmigiano Reggiano deliver a calcium and protein punch and are lower in fat than most cheeses. Plus, Parmigiano is very low in lactose, which is important if you're lactose intolerant. Always grate your own when you can. That keeps the flavor bright and tangy and brilliant. I think that's enough. So, say cheese and join me later in the show for my chef and the approved and budget friendly pasta shells with melty butternut squash and Parmigiano Reggiano. Butternut squash has become a staple of a healthy and tasty winter diet. Soups, stews, side dishes, it's a universally loved vegetable that keeps for two months or more. And today, it's part of this wonderful melty butternut squash and whole wheat pasta dish. You need to peel the butternut squash and then you just make cubes out of it. They don't have to be perfectly the same size, but it helps that they're approximately the same size. We're gonna saute some onion and butternut squash for this melty, beautiful, healthy, easy to make dish. And we start by heating a little oil in a large saucepan. It's extra light olive oil, which has a very high smoke temperature and is great for sauteing. Add the onion, then the butternut squash. The oil helps you absorb the beta carotene in the butternut squash. And that's one of the reasons to saute it. Now, you can add the garlic with this too. I'm just gonna let that saute for a few minutes. Butternut squash has actually been called a superfood in some medical journals because of the nutrients it packs. Not only beta carotene, but potassium, vitamin C, iron. And this recipe is so easy to make, it actually gets better in flavor the next day. The antioxidants in butternut squash actually help your arteries from rusting, keeps them from rusting. And the dish itself actually has a low glycemic load. It raises your blood sugar gently and not quickly, which is especially important if you have diabetes. Now, what we'll do next is add some good vegetable broth and some good white wine. It's important that this broth get hot. We'll add the whole wheat pasta too, but I won't do that now because it takes 12 minutes to get all the way done. I already have one done. Good garlic, good onion, beautiful butternut squash, nice and soft. Now, a little bit about our food as medicine ingredient, Parmigiano Reggiano. Parmigiano Reggiano is a high protein cheese. In fact, it's 36% protein. You know, one of the nice things about Parmigiano Reggiano is that a little looks like a lot. That's actually barely an ounce of cheese. A little bit of sage. Why sage? Because it's classic with Parmigiano Reggiano and uh, it smells like fall and winter put together. It's really fabulous. I'm just going to slice a little bit so that I'll be able to sprinkle it on top. You'll get that little bit of pungency as you eat and it provides terrific color contrast as well. There you have it. Melty butternut squash with whole wheat pasta shells and Parmigiano Reggiano. For the complete recipe, check out our website. And remember, the fountain of youth starts in the kitchen. Chadani, may you live 100 years. For Chef MD, I'm Dr. John Lacuma. Learn more about culinary medicine today. Order Chef MD's Big Book of Culinary Medicine at chefmd.com and sign up for free weekly recipe emails while you're there.